what's up? I wanted to make a video about an experience that I had uh, not too long ago. I relapsed and I started smoking and I smoked for about two weeks and of course I got into a huge depression, the anxiety, the panic attacks, you know, the feeling like a loser, not moving forward in life, blah 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 blah. I decided to start vaping and what happened is that when I started vaping without any cigarettes I still went through all the physical withdrawal those first few days and I was like why am I f not only feeling this way but why am I still craving the cigarettes if I'm feeding my body by vaping nicotine on a constant basis throughout the day why do I still find myself craving a cigarette? And why am I feeling that irritable, you know, anxiety ridden, just, you know, that roar, that rage when you, when you quit cold turkey? Why am I feeling that? If I'm, if I'm vaping and giving myself nicotine, why am I going through all this withdrawal? I'm convinced that there's something in cigarettes other than nicotine that you're addicted to. I mean, there's 4,000 chemicals. 4,000. There's bleach, there's ammonia, there's rat poison, there's battery acid, there's worm killer. The list goes on and on and on and on. So, you know, you, you smoke those things 20 times a day for 10, 15, 20, 30 years. Who knows what, what when you take all that stuff away and you go cold turkey, who knows what that's going to feel like when you come off of all those drugs. You know, it's not just nicotine that you're addicted to. It's all that other crap. It's all that other crap that makes you feel bad too. So what's the point of all of this? Is that it's... Two, 2015 is almost over. And it's fucking stupid to smoke. It really is. You've got two options in life. You either A, you quit cold turkey, go through all the pain... It's going to be a while, but you go through all the pain and be done with it. Or two, start vaping. Just today, a girl on my Facebook posted this article of a Harvard study where they found a drug called diacetyl that was in some of the flavors of e-cigarettes that is known to cause, you know, respiratory disease or something to that effect. And she and she made this comment like, you yeah, told you so. <laughs> and I'm thinking, what a moron. So yeah, so there's so there's one chemical in e-cigs, diacetyl, that's bad for you. There's four thousand, let me repeat, four thousand chemicals in cigarettes that are bad for you. So you make the call. One versus four thousand. You know, what's your choice? Make the smart one. Peace.